doing? Just videotaping the situation. Can you please leave the scene here? I'm on the traffic stop. I'll stay out of your way. I'm just holding everybody accountable here with the camera. Keep this rolling in case uh, it comes up. Oh, you know, sir. That's that's you not to important. I've seen with a with a handgun. Uh, it's it's not illegal to open carry in New Mexico. Right, but you're carrying a handgun to my traffic stop. Um. I'm, I just want to hold everybody accountable with my video camera. So what's your name, sir? That's not important. I have not broken any law. I'm not under... I'm going to be free to go. Am I free to go, sir? Am I being detained? Okay, thank you. Still up behind me. Still waiting. Hold on, I'm being uh, stopped. One sec. I'm counting. That's a play. One sec. Sorry. By, the, by my supervisor requesting me now. You came up on my traffic stop with a handgun. Um, you have an ID on you? Is that? Uh, yeah. Am I, am I'm, I being, I'm protecting myself. Am I being detained right now? I'm protecting myself. Am I, have I broken any law? You walked up on my traffic stop with bearing a handgun. It was... That's my safety. My safety. I did not do anything illegal, sir. That's my safety. I did not act in any hostile way. I obeyed your uh, command. Okay, well I'm asking you if you have your ID now. Am I legally required to present that? Yes, you are, because you walked on my seat presenting a handgun. I did not present a handgun. That... Yeah, you did. You have a handgun in your presence right now. It's not illegal to have, have handguns a handgun on my person. You have a license to carry it? I don't need a license to open carry in New Mexico. Yes, you do. You need a license to carry your handgun. Not to open carry. New Mexico state law. Not to open carry. You have an ID on you? I do, but am I legally re required to pre pre present that? How are you doing, sir? Good, you? This guy walks up on my, ha on my scene with a handgun. I'm over here on a traffic stop and he's displaying a handgun, and, you know, and he's videotaping me. Uh, I got a call that uh, my girlfriend w had been pulled over and I wanted to make sure she was okay. And yeah, why well, don't just carry it on his uh, right side? I open carry. It's not illegal I mean, to do in New Mexico. Well, I understand stop. that, but do you understand the situation here? Yes, sir. And when I when I walked up to the scene, uh, the officer asked me to, to uh, you know, not get in his way. I, I don't remember the exact words. And I said, all right, I'll stand over here. And I, I stood... I don't know, 20 feet away on the other side of the street. And well, I did not be officer here in my, uh, I did not do any hostile actions or say anything to that effect. I acted in a lawful manner. Do you have ID on you? I do. Can I display your ID, please? Am I legally required to present that right now? Being that you are displaying a weapon, yes. You are. I advised you of that already. We are required to make sure you're not a felon because... Can you show me the uh, the statute that says I have to produce ID on command if I'm not in violation of breaking a law? Well, look, this can go two ways. You can try to play hardball here on the side of the road, or we can just take you in and we'll settle this at the station, and it's not going to go. I haven't broken any law. I have not broken any law. 
Well, you're getting close right now by not presenting ID. Am I legally? You do have to, you do have to I'm legally ID required to present ID. Yes. It, it, if I'm not, I have not committed an offense or am suspected of an offense. Why wouldn't you want to present your ID? Because I value my privacy. Well, you walk on my scene on a traffic stop with a showing, displaying a weapon on your side. You don't think that that's in violation of me doing my job? I had no intention and to interfere you with the camera. I had no and intention. For what purposes? I don't know. Look, sir, the situation is really simple. Okay, it's a real simple situation. You present your ID, we run it, make sure you're clear, and you're right. You're not. You have every right to, to display a firearm. Right. But what our job is is to make sure that you're not a felon in possession of a firearm. That's that's against the law. That's what we're trying to look at. So are you guys telling me that you stop everybody open carrying and ask them to produce ID to make sure they're not a felon? Well, I'll I, give you one situation. I have not broken any laws. Listen to me. I'm going to give you all the respect in the world, but I expect the same, okay? Understandable? Sure. Go ahead. We were working an operation a few weeks ago at Walmart. We had somebody walk up on us and display a firearm as well. It was a real simple thing, sir. Can you please produce your ID? You are not in violation of any law at this time, but mm -hmm. we do need to make sure you're not a felon. What, what, what would be the case if uh, we had felons all over the place displaying firearms? I, I mean, these are hypotheticals. I know that I did not break any law, and per the law as I understand it, I don't have to produce ID unless <coughs> I've, you know, broken a law. And you guys, you, you just told me that I had not yet broken a law, and I don't intend to break well, any laws. Listen to me. As far as what's happened on his stop and all that, I don't know. Okay. I'm just simply coming to back up a fellow officer. And uh, I actually have another appointment now, saw him out, coming to check on him, see what the situation is. Sure, and it's I'd like real... to be free to go. Am I being detained? Can I go? Am I free to go? Am, am I free to go? You have an ID on you? I already answered in the Maybe affirmative that you, I do. You showed up on my scene. Um, I, I feel that I have the right for me to check on you because you're coming in on my scene with a handgun. Uh, videotaping me, which isn't was, isn't a crime, but now I gotta I gotta wonder why you're on my scene with a with a handgun, not a law enforcement officer at that. Because I want to make sure my girlfriend is not my, mistreated. For my safety, and I want to make sure I don't for. Normally, get other individuals walking up on my scene. Well, maybe with a, with a handgun. Well, and, and other officers coming in to assist me. That, sure. You know, that's how we do things here in the state of New Mexico. Sure, sure. You know, I know. We don't know who we don't know who's gonna uh, come out and do something. To to us as officers. Sure. But and the I, reality here is that um, what do you have to what do you have to hide? I mean, if you're willing to my privacy to provide, provide my privacy, that sir. My privacy. I value my privacy. Right. You're probably from North or South Carolina, correct? I don't. That, am I, am I legally required to answer that question? That's probably you're from South Carolina. I'm, I'm, that's what I'm assuming. Well, if I'm, if I'm not legally required to answer that question, I'm not going to. And if, unless I'm being detained here, I'm, and I'm. I'm going to leave the scene, and I'm, I have no intention of doing anything illegal. I just want to be free to go. I'm a, I'm a, a law-abiding person. I think we have the same rights, regardless of if we have badges or not. Look, sir, law-abiding citizen or not, I mean, if you were law-abiding, I've never had anybody refuse to show us an ID if they didn't have something to hide, especially if you come up on his incident. Okay, I appreciate your concern. You know, with a gun. I mean, that I, would definitely be alarming to me, too. Sure, I appreciate your concern, but per the law, if I'm not being detained, I have not broken any law, I, I do not need to produce identification, so I'm going to leave the scene in a peaceful manner. I wish you guys a good day.